Hi, this is Kushbu with another question of Euclid Geometry. This is question number 2 from exercise 5.1, page number 85 from NCRT. This says, give a definition for each of the following terms. How many terms we want to define? Karna hai. Are there other terms that need to be defined first? Kya inko define karne se pehle? Hame kuch four terms pata honi chahiye? And what are they? And how might you define them? So, first part hume given hai, parallel lines. Parallel lines hoti hai. This line and this line. Suppose this is L, this is M. In the beach ka consistently distance same on a perpendicular distance, dono lines ka parapa rena chaye, bilkul. Throughout the lines cha the bani we to go lines parallel. So if the perpendicular distance between Two lines is always constant. In them, get them parallel lines. Yeah, fair. The lines which never intersect. The lines which never intersect each other. Intersect each other. So, parallel lines ko define karne ke liye pehle kya pata hona chahiye hame pata hona chahiye point ke bare mein jo aap line draw kar rahe hain ki point kya hota hai line kya hoti hai aur lines ke beech mein perpendicular distance kya hota hai so we require to define to define a point line and perpendicular distance between lines between two lines. So, ye terms are going to say, pehle pata hai chahi. Now, second part, which is perpendicular lines. Perpendicular lines kya hoti hai? Perpendicular lines are, suppose, jaysi hi. Suppose, this is P and this is Q. Ye lines hai. Ye lines intersect kar rahi hai 90 by 2. Aisi lines, chuki 90 degree per intersect kar rahi hai, unhaan kheta hai perpendicular lines. So the lines which intersect each other intersect each other at 90 degree. Inam kehte hain perpendicular lines. Isse pehle we require to define find point pata hona chahiye hume line and angle. Point kya hota hai, line kya hoti hai, angle kya hota hai. Then part third, which is line segment. Line segment is this thing. This is a line segment. So a straight line drawn from one uh, point, one end of a point. This is third part. Straight line drawn from one end of a point. This is the line segment. So, line segment is point pata hona and line segment. So, we require to define, to define point and a line segment. And a line. Fourth main radius of circle. This is a circle. This is the center. This is OA. This is the radius. Or this OB. This is the radius. OC, this is the radius, OD, OE, OF. That means center se lekar, circle ke kisi bhi point par. Maa se leke maa tar ka jo distance hai, that is radius. So the distance between the center of circle, between the center of a circle and Any other point lying on the circle is called radius. We require to define. We require to define point and radius. So, a point or radius we know. So, basically, the formula is what is 
एक्चुअली रेडियस को डिफाइन करने के लिए आपको क्या चाहिए सेम वे इज पार्ट फिफ्थ में है स्क्वेयर स्क्वेयर इज बेसिकली फोर साइड क्वार लैटरल जिसमें ऑल साइड इक्वल होती है और हर कॉर्नर एंगल इज ऑफ नाइन्टी डिग्रीज सो क्वार लैटरल ऑल साइड इक्वल एंड ईच एंगल इज ऑफ नाइन्टी डिग्री सो इससे पहले आपको ये पता हो रिक्वायर टू रिफाइन रिक्वायर टू डिफाइन एंड एंगल क्वार लैक्टर एंड साइड सो दिस वॉज क्वेश्चन नंबर सेकेंड फ्रॉम एक्सरसाइज फाइव पॉइंट वन एंड डू वॉच द नेक्स्ट वीडियो फॉर सम मोर क्वेश्चन गुड बाय